an emergency session for the African Union. Permanent representatives gather in Addis Ababa to discuss ways to combat an epidemic that's triggered global alarm. The Ebola virus disease is spreading quickly. The heartbreak is a public health and humanitarian emergency of international concern. Uh, it is therefore urgent for us to take appropriate measures and joint actions in order to control the epidemic and protect our people. UN officials also made clear just how dire the situation is on the ground. The story of Ebola in West Africa today is a story of lack. We lack everything. In the areas where the outbreak first started, it took a very big toll on our health workers because health workers were treating Ebola patients lacking supplies, lacking the basic gloves and, and basic sanitation. Several countries have promised to help. Few so far have done very much. The president of Liberia was on a CNN program explaining that of all of the resources pledged so far, only the money that the government of Liberia has put into the crisis has actually reached and the in-kind contribution by uh, the, the People's Republic of China. All of the rest are still in talk form. Locals in Liberia's capital Monrovia have made clear they are aware of who is helping them. China has sent medical supplies and experts into Liberia and to the other hardest hit countries, Sierra Leone and Guinea. China's President Xi Jinping says his government and people will continue to help the three countries to beat Ebola. The AU is to hold a conference in Addis Ababa next month to raise more money for the fight against Ebola. Wazir Khamsin, CCTV.